Now cross over to the comfortable chair with Sixpence Jeremy and our special guest. Take it away, Sixpence. Welcome and thank you for joining us on the Comfortable Chair program. It was formerly known as the Hot Seat program until we realized we did not want to put our honorable ministers into a hot seat and ask them difficult questions. So we have given them a comfortable chair on which we ask them luxurious questions which they can answer at their leisure. Today on the Comfortable Chair program, we have none other than the great minister of impending projects. The minister is a gallant son and daughter of the soil. He is known for keeping his sovereignty in his top pocket and is known for his famous saying, you will never eat polony again. Minister, we'd like to thank you for joining us on the program. Uh, uh, thank you, uh, you are, you are honoured. Now, Minister, please tell the people a, a little bit about your ministry. Uh, all right, uh, thank you for that question. Uh, uh, that's that's a, a very good question, uh, Sixpence. Uh, it has a fact, uh, which is a fact in itself. Uh, my mandate or my portfolio is is, is thus, or, or this, uh, depending on the level of education of the uh, populace there. Uh, my ministry is the Ministry of Impending Projects. What I do is that I send out my project officers out to you, uh, the populace, uh, in your areas. Uh, if you have any projects, such as uh, uh, winter wheat, uh, pigari, um, but, uh, sorry, tobacco, uh, my project officers will then uh, bring these proposals uh, to me and I file them. Uh, yes, yes. Because if, if you actually want anything to happen, that is the Ministry of Projects. I am impending projects. Mm. Yes, I think you can see the diametrically opposing uh, scenarios uh, of that uh, projection. Mm. Yes. yes, Minister, thank you for that. We realize you cannot uh, actually divulge uh, what is going on in these specific projects. If you are to reveal it to the people, it could compromise national security. However, uh, we would like to know about this rumor we have heard of a possible gala bash for the Jatropa project. Uh, uh, thank you for that question. Uh, 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 that's a, a very pertinent question, uh, and, and I will answer that question. Uh, yes, it has indeed been 10 years uh, since we uh, began the uh, Jatrofa research project. And, uh, and uh, as you uh, successfully alluded to, it's the 10th anniversary, yes indeed. And uh, to commemorate it, what we shall be doing is having a, a gala bash to celebrate this a great achievement of this uh, project. And uh, there will be various forms of entertainment available for the uh, populace. Uh, we shall be having uh, these, uh, I believe you call them up and coming artists. <laughs> no, I, I prefer to call them impending artists <laughs> because they've not yet quite uh, arrived. <laughs> yes, and uh, I uh, myself and I, uh, I will be releasing uh, my album. Uh, it's called uh, Give Me Some More Ah, woo -woo. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Minister. We'd like to thank you very much for joining us on the Comfortable Chair program. That has been the gallant son and daughter of the soil, the Minister of Impending Projects. Minister, thank you very much. Uh, thank you. Uh, you are all honored. Thank you. Thanks. I like to do these things for, thanks, for, you. for the, the, the population. No, I think it's been enlightening. Uh, very good. And you are very patriotic. I like that. Uh, stick to the core. Very good. Uh, I think you deserve a farm for that one. Or maybe. Oh, you don't know what a diamond mine? Good to you. Yeah. Which brings us to our next section, the So Says Me Street section. For our younger viewers, today's letter D for democracy. Democracy is like a merry-go-round. Once you get on, you can't get off. Calm in the middle and rough at the edges. If you do get off, you'll get beaten by the school bully, thrown against the jungle gym, and your body will be thrown down the slide as collateral damage. That's been the So Says Me Street section today for our younger viewers. D for the young at heart. Now, introductions on a deeper level, we now move on to the spirit media. I say hello, hello, brothers and sisters out there in TV land. 
I am Pastor Olufuweni, all the way from Detroit, Michigan, that is the United States of America, where I have a big, I say a big church, hallelujah, glory, and I've just received a word. I said I've received a word from all night to come down to your small little country right here in Africa and give you the word. I said give you the word, what? The word, brothers and sisters, my word is you have got to pray. You have got to pray. Never give up praying because the devil is there. The devil is alive. If you don't believe in him, he believes in you. So you got to remember always and always to pray. Glory. And now to the best part of this entire program, the entertainment segment. I'm going to introduce to you a band that needs no introduction. I'll introduce them. They are a young up-and-coming hip-hop band called the Even Mo Little Swaggery Boys. And they consist of A Little Angry, D Brick Wall, Lil Sneezy, Young Trunkle. And they're bringing us their breakthrough single, All of the Lost. They turned off their lights in here, baby. Extra dark, I can see shit. Turned off the lights in here, baby. Know what I mean? They turned off everything. They turned off everything. Crashed cars, house alarms. I can't even, even see where we are. If you have a generator, it will power your lights. If you have an inverter, it can also power your lights. Business meeting, wrinkle church, gotta go, late for work, I is dead, I've blown a fuse, I need that base, what I'ma do? I'm heading home, I'm almost there, I'm on my way. Heading up the stairs To my surprise, no electricity What they think, this some ghetto university Candle lights, phone lights, robot lights Lights are lights, no house lights, no street lights Bloody rover, zes are cutting corners. Turn on the lights, inverter, generator in that order. The action of a nation, border to border. With no gates, we're playing Uno with our daughters. I'm feeling great, my dogs are fed. Hang on the wait, that was a slice of bread. Get the dog food, warm water, please. I fuck the powers, cut the geezer and the pressure feed. Candle lights, phone lights, robot lights, lights are lights, no house. Morning, I was gonna take a shower, but the geezer isn't running. Freaking power cut, 
Winter's apart us and the cold shower's not an option I'll give it 30 minutes, she will be on and popping An hour passes, what? And then an hour 30 Oh Zessa, don't stress us, please bring back the power early Who is to blame for this anyhow? Okay, let's see Who is the one who is overusing the magazine? Should we point at the company that's supposed to supply? Should we blame it on the ECO? N-O-M-Y, okay, okay, to whom we may concern our right, maybe the residents who don't turn off their light. Thank you very much for joining us. This is Jerome and his team signing out. Mandabe and his team, enjoy the rest of your viewing. Good night, Shem, Shoyahembe and his colleagues. Good night. I think the music's already started and they can't hear you. What's with your accent? You're you okay with some. I mean, I mean, yeah. oi, oi, listen, hey, no, so, what, what about my accent, accents, man? Come What's wrong with my accent? Gwashi, gwashi accents. What, 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 about, what about yours, mate? All of the lies, all of the